Russia developing a hypersonic sniper rifle. Let's go. Yeah. So far, only a Russian defense contractor, Lebivans, is known to be working on a hypersonic sniper rifle that could propel a bullet to nearly Mach 6 velocity. Snipers have to consider various external ballistic factors, including wind values, elevation, and even air density, to realize maximum accuracy, and that too under narrow time limits. These estimations can vary depending upon target distance and environmental factors. However, hypersonic bullets would enable the snipers to maximize accuracy by minimizing the impact of external factors by their drastically faster velocities, according to Lebeve. The company told a Russian defense publication in 2017 that it is developing ammunition with a muzzle velocity of over 2,000 meters per second, roughly 6 Mach, that will allow a sniper to shoot at 1,000 meters without making adjustments. Also, the hypersonic munition can be fired up to 7 kilometers, which is impressive considering that conventional rifles have a range between 1 and 2 kilometers. These hypersonic cartridges will not be loaded with gunpowder, as it will not be able to provide enough pressure to realize such a high muzzle velocity. So Lebeve will use certain chemicals, which are under wraps. Experts say that while it is theoretically possible to create such a cartridge, it will need a solid barrel and mechanisms, and the assembled rifle could be bulky. According to Russian Special Forces veteran Sergei Gontrov, such a powerful rifle would make a lot of noise that would give away the sniper's position. He also noted that the recoil of such a rifle would be twice as powerful as standard sniper rifles. Gontrov further said that if the rifle weighed 20 kilograms, it would simply be impossible for the sniper to carry it around. Lebeve admits that a hypersonic rifle will be less durable than a conventional one because of chemical cartridges. Therefore the company maintains that its hypersonic rounds are not a replacement for traditional sniper ammunition but a cost-effective option in specific use cases with extremely severe environments or long ranges.